Do you like my new face? Hey there guys, it's me, Control here, and welcome back to another Minecraft mod review. Now the mod I've got for today is the scuba gear mod for Minecraft 1.4.7, and this adds a load of gear for scubaing, as you could probably tell from the title. Now it adds, I think, about five or six new items um, to the game, which have all got their own crafting recipes, except two, which, I lied, they do have their own crafting recipes, just you can't spoil them in in creative mode for some reason, which is actually really annoying because I had to keep going through and actually crafting them, which got a bit repetitive. Uh, so, we have a snorkel. Now, you craft that with two iron, two glass panes, which I actually think is a really nice feature because glass panes for the little uh, bits of glass and the goggles instead of always just glass. Uh, two lapis for the blue colour, I suppose. A glass bottle to store some air and some string. Not sure what that's for, but okay. And that will give you your snorkel. Now we have an ADS Tritona. Not a clue what the ADS stands for. And Tritona is just a cool name. So basically, some weird helmet you wear on your head. Uh, and that needs, I think that's 7 iron. Uh, not 64 glass, I don't know why I did that. And some vines. Now, not entirely sure what the vines are for, but fair enough. It makes the crafting recipe look cool. So I'll go with that. And we also have this kind of scary looking uh, scuba single air tank, or you can get a double air tank uh, by re replacing that with a double air tank. So you need two lapis, four iron, two leather, and that will give you this. Um, so if I go ahead into this chest, there are quite a lot of crafting recipes today. Uh, for the air tank, you need five iron, uh, two glass bottles, and two lapis, and that will just give you your single air tank. And for the double air tank, you need two air tanks, three string to join them, and some iron. Why not just throw in some iron go for it? And that will give you a double air tank. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go ahead and craft um, the helmet with the double air tank in. Um, somehow, let me just grab all this stuff. You know, I can just prove to you that these crafting recipes work because you do just look at them and not have a clue if they're actually going to work or not. Um, I think it's like that. I may have uh, forgotten which way around it is. Uh, there we go. Okay, there we go. So we have our scuba with a double air tank. See, I don't lie about my crafting recipes. So if I go ahead and shove on our snorkel, it will give you a really cool kind of helmet thing. It has a weird grey thing going straight into your face. You can still just about see your eyes and the snorkel coming out the side if I spin around really fast. I hope you can see that. And basically what will happen now if I go ahead and jump into the water... I will have 1.5 times the amount of oxygen. Now, what I originally thought um, is that this bar will go down a little bit slower, but that's not actually the case, as you can see in a second. If I just wait for this to run out, as you can see, we get a message saying diving gear, zero uses left, and it refills our little oxygen meter um, back up to halfway. Now, that's kind of cool. I really like that. I thought it would just go down slower, which is boring. Uh, but one thing you must uh, take care of now, which is a little bit weird, is that if I go ahead and jump back in now, uh, you would expect to be able to use your snorkel again now that you've filled up on oxygen, but that is not the case, which I really don't like, um, because as you can see, I'm going to have to get ready to jump out so I don't die, uh, but as you can see, it will say zero uses left, and you will start dying. Um, which I really don't know why, because obviously your snorkel won't break if you use it more than once. I'm not sure why it does that, it's kind of annoying, especially as it's not exactly easy to craft. Um, but I don't know why that happens, I really think that should be changed. Now, if we go ahead and go to the ADS Tritona, um, basically this will double your oxygen. So if I go ahead and take a look at my face, I have to show you my face when I'm wearing all these, because they do have kind of cool textures. Uh, this one especially makes me look very ugly. If I go ahead and jump into the water now, if I wait for that to run out, I don't know, it might take a long time, so I might just not wait. Uh, but basically, it will refill it again, and you will get double the amount of oxygen. I'm not going to wait, because you can kind of see what's going to happen before it does. Now, if I go ahead and grab our scuba with a double air tank, which is six times. That one is three times, by the way. I'm not going to show you that, because there's no point. I can just show you the six times. Um, this one kind of does make me look like Darth Vader, so I do want to kind of make some sort of Star Wars joke here, but I'm not going to because uh, there goes all my street cred if I do. <laughs> uh, so if I go ahead and jump in, my oxygen bar will go down 
And as soon as it gets to the bottom, just wait for it any second now. Any second now, guys. Don't panic. Uh, there we go. So we now have five uses left. So you can sit down here until get, that gets down all the way to zero uses left. And then you'll start dying. And I don't know if there's actually a way you can replace it, um, which is kind of annoying. Uh, if you have to craft it all again, as you saw, it was kind of expensive. Uh, but this is actually really cool if you want to do some underwater building. But other than that, I'm not entirely sure why you would actually want this scuba uh, diving gear. I think it's a kind of cool idea. I think Mojang really needs to kind of catch up and make something for under the water. Because at the moment, it's kind of boring. I mean, we've got some squids we can attack. There is some clay you can mine. Uh, but they really need to add some sort of achievement or something at least uh, for you actually to do under water. Because it's... It is actually kind of boring. Now, one thing that the mod developer has said, he's done something really cool. He has made this compatible, I think, with Thorncraft. I think that's the one. Um, and basically, if you have some machines, you can actually pump oxygen downwards into your helmet if you stay close enough to the pump. Um, and you can have unlimited oxygen, which I think is actually a really cool idea. Uh, the use of, like, the Tekkit machinery, I think that's really awesome. Um, and he is actually planning a full-body... Um, diving gear suit, which sounds pretty cool. Um, I'm not sure how that would work, uh, but it sounds pretty cool. So that is the diving gear mod for Minecraft 1.4.7. At the moment, I'm not going to lie, there's probably not much use in this mod at the moment. It would be a great mod if Mojang could create something for you to actually do underwater, uh, but at the moment there isn't anything. So this mod is really good in the fact that it's not overpowered. But I'm actually going to go out on a limb and say that it's overpowered, which is slightly annoying. So, thanks for watching, guys. There's links to download in the description. Uh, let's see if you can leave us a like uh, or hit subscribe. So, thanks for watching, guys. Control, signing out.